So Laura, what a great day of golf it was to watch. Obviously a great one to play in as well. Just one short in the end, but what a fantastic effort from you. You must be very proud. Thank you. Yeah, I'm very happy. Um, I think I had a very poor ninth, uh, seventh hole. Uh, hit it straight in the fairway, probably first fairway hit of the week, um, which is technically the main part in that hole. And then had um, a poorly executed shot, and that kind of threw me back a little bit because I think until then I was, I was cruising and I had uh, lots of birdie chances. Uh, lots of them I just left short on the line, um, so I felt like I, I had a chance. I just need to stay patient. Um, so then I had to, yeah, fight back a little bit, and I'm quite happy I did. And you fought back really, really impressively. I mean, just short in the end, but you must be so proud of how you handled the pressure in the final day? Yeah, definitely. I mean, to be fair, I didn't really know. I was just one shot back. Uh, I was just focused on trying to do uh, my thing and follow my game plan. Um, and Rosie kept me nice and loose. Um, I kind of got an idea that it was tight around our group, um, probably on the last tee box um, and then into the green. Um, and she told me, just give it a chance on the last. Um, I did just miss, <laughs> but uh, yeah, no, I'm quite happy. I was just going to ask you about your caddy, actually. How much of a help is it to have a player on the bag? Oh, definitely. Uh, I mean, it's just very funny in general. That helps, keeps you loose during a, during a final round. Um, then she reads the greens incredibly well. Um, so most of the time, I didn't quite see it, and she would just tell me, no, that's actually a bit more, a bit less, and that definitely helps. So, yeah, no, it's been really, really good. Well, it's been a great week, and I hope this gives you fantastic confidence for the end of the season. Definitely. Well Looking forward to it. Thank you.